the architect and contractor Connor meet at the almost finished structure to check it for air tightness. They're going to use a blower door test. A frame covered with an airtight membrane is fitted into the front door frame. An important component of a blower door test setup is a powerful fan. The fan is installed in the opening of the membrane. The values required for measuring are programmed in, and measuring begins. Negative pressure builds up inside the structure. The membrane at the measuring apparatus bulges inwards. The fan blows the indoor air out of the structure to produce a negative pressure of 50 pascal in the interior. It then pumps outdoor air into the structure to produce a positive pressure of 50 pascal in the interior. This corresponds approximately to gale force 5. This test determines the N50 value, that is the structure's air change rate. This value is calculated by dividing the fan's hourly delivery rate by the heated indoor air volume. The structure being tested here has an indoor air volume of 250 cubic meters. At a positive pressure of 50 pascal, 420 cubic meters of heated air escape every hour. Therefore, the air change rate is 1.6 per hour. That is the limit value to comply with. The architect planned the structure with a ventilation system. The permitted limited value was exceeded, so contractor Connor has to search for leaks. In order to do so, he fills the entire structure with theatrical smoke. A positive pressure is established. It's now possible to see from the outside where smoke is escaping through the building envelope. Contractor Connor has discovered a plume of smoke coming out near a skylight. It's not the skylight itself that's leaky. It's the joint between the vapor barrier and the skylight frame. A thermal anemometer is used to measure the speed of the incoming air. We perceive inflowing air with a speed of more than 0.2 meters per second as unpleasant. It feels drafty. The leak is quickly fixed with a short piece of Siga Corvum. Contractor Connor checks his handiwork again with the thermo anemometer. A portable smoke machine can be used to conduct a simple check of component connections. A quick blast of smoke is sufficient to observe where it's forced out through any leaks by the positive pressure. Air is escaping at the overlap of the membranes where they are joined to the wall. The consequence, toxic mold can form in a very short time. <laughs> Contractor Connor uses Siga Premur to repair the leak. The smoke proves it. No more air is escaping.
Air flows are readily detectable by hand. They can be made visible using a portable smoke machine. This leak is repaired with a short piece of Siga Risan. Finally, contractor Connor repeats the blower door measurement. What improvement has been achieved by the corrections? The air change rate is now well below the required maximum of 1.5. Satisfaction all round at the job site. Contractor Connor hands the architect a test record for the measurement that was performed.